Oh, what's going on with you YouTube? Jumping Chris here. We're coming back at y'all with another vid, and today we're gonna do a little mall vlog here in a little bit. But before I do that, I need to open this package from the good people over at Street Market Supply. I wear their clothes all the time. They have you know a couple drops here and there throughout the year. They do a lot of vintage graphic tees and also great looking shorts and the hat as well. A lot of people ask where I get my hats, my tees. I get a lot of stuff from Street Market Supply, and they're doing a drop. Uh, today, this Friday, August 19th at 9 a.m. Pacific time, which is Eastern time, 12 o'clock noon. So make sure you guys uh, check out the site, guys. And if you guys want to cop a t-shirt, some shorts, make sure you guys do. Because they got some really nice uh, tees. Ooh, again, man, we got some shorts up in here. Oh, this, they spoil me. They spoil me. Oh, they got the Travis Scott tee right here. This is fire with the La Flames on the back. Oh man, this is nice. I like this a lot. These are fire. Can't forget the shorts too, the LV shorts. Now this one's actually kind of funky, man. I like this one. Oh man, I'm gonna have to rock this together, man. For real, man. And of course, the Drake t-shirt right here. Staying alive, staying alive. <laughs> Here it is, man. This is the Drake tee. Now, this tee is fire too as well. Look at that right there. Drake on the front and on the back. Check it out right there. Woo. Man. These are fire, man. Hey, definitely. You guys go. Definitely, guys, make sure you guys check out the site today, uh, Friday. Uh, they're going to be dropping stuff right now. Oh, look at these shorts, bro. This is like a camel, a camel print shorts here with the LV yeah oh yeah they definitely did their thing man hey I'm gonna I'm gonna try to uh, put some fits together I'll put on my IG and all that stuff too, too so make sure you guys follow me on IG but definitely make sure you guys check out street market supply they're doing a drop uh, Friday August 19th at 9 a.m. Pacific time so by the time I drop this video they should be already having a drop all right so make sure you guys check it out Bust out the old CP3 homes. Remember these used to, these came out back in. When did come back out? I don't know. But yep, I love 13s. So we're here at my local mall. Uh, today's Friday. I'm pretty sure these things are sitting. I mean, usually 13s just don't really move like that. So anyway, just want to take a look at them, man. So see if you guys think maybe you guys want to end up copping or not. Kid sizes, where's the men sizes? Alright, one sec. Let me see that coffee stand real quick. Yeah, it's oh, pretty crap. Man, that's pretty bad. It makes it look real ugly. You see how it like kind of damaged that too? Yeah, it makes you don't even want to wear it anymore. I know. I literally just traded dude last night, so I, I didn't I'm have just no kidding. I would, I would still rock him. I don't care. I see we have the Jordan 13 box. And this is... Jordan 13 Retro French Blue. And. Okay. They nice. I'm feeling these. Alright. I like 13s though. You guys already know. 13s is actually my favorite silhouette Jordan. Basically, what I grew up on. This is when it came out when I was like in maybe. I think 13 came out when I was like in the seventh grade. Anyway, so I'm telling how old I am. Got the hologram Panther Eye there. The good. Uh, tumble leather that toe box man if it was white it would have been nice but I don't know that gray's kind of throwing me off the Jordan tag on the tongue you guys should be have the X I I I so the X 13 in in Roman numerals got the tumble leather tongue with the red jump man again the suede material this suede is like a navy so it's actually I uh, so suede got the suede wrap midsole which I appreciate and of course you got the panther prop paul the hologram on the bottom carbon fiber and the 
one thing I like about Jordan 13s is that it's just comfortable. They are comfortable. They're probably one of the most comfortable Jordans out there. Not too heavy, not too like, you know, but not too bulky or anything. It, it, just, it feels right, that's why I love 13s. But you know, I mainly try to get a lot of OG colorways. I know the playoff 13s is supposed to be coming out, but the, the thing is, a lot of people just kind of disrespect 13s, man. I don't know. I don't think a lot of people feel 13s. I just have a love for it because it's nostalgic for me. But they yeah, are, man. They cool. You know, I believe they're even sitting on the Snickers app or whatever. They're probably gonna be chilling at your local store. Super GR um, or pretty GR. So I don't think anyone should have a problem getting these things. But they are cool. I like them. If you guys want them, these are 13. I think they retail at 200. You know, with that $10 price increase compared to 190 from last year. But it is what it is. All right, guys. So there you guys have it. French blue 13s. Y'all copping? Concords fives. Join in the back. Purple. Not a dark purple. It is <laughs> more purple than in person. But he's chilling. Looky, looky what we have here. I believe these just came out today too as well. Allen AI. I think these are the question. The blue toes. This is the one that, I, if I'm not mistaken, is where the famous where he crossed over Jordan, right? These are clean. Even though it's a Reebok, whatevs, questions. I remember growing up, I was a huge AI fan. Got the icy blue bottoms, the three in the back. Yeah, these are nice. Nah, they're definitely nice. Hey. Yeah. You like the questions better or you like the answers? Questions, right? The OG, the original. The new, the new one says the answer is more it's yeah. trash. And what you guys know about classic Reeboks, I used to rock these all the time in high school. <laughs> all right, we back at the crib, man. Just want to have a little discussion. I know that the playoff 13s have been announced. These things, I, I believe, they're going to release during All Star Weekend in 2023. I wonder if a lot of people are going to be excited for these, you know? Because the thing is, I just think the majority of people don't really like 13s. I have a whole story about this when I was a kid and stuff, but we don't really need to get into that. But, you know, I still love 13s. It's like, as I was saying, this is probably my favorite silhouette of all time just because, like, this is my nostalgia. This is what I grew up on. I, I remember having these when I was in seventh grade and stuff. So, you know, this is near and dear to my heart for 13. Regular, just just regular non-OG colorways. It's just kind of, you know, I, I like the skip marks. I have a whole bunch of 13s in my collection. But if they ever come back out with the Jordan 13 Wheats or the University Blue, whoo, I will be on board. I would definitely. I might have to get like two pairs. I, I cannot, like, seriously, look at that Wheat 13. These are... This is back in 2004, if I'm not mistaken. Definitely. But anyways, guys, just want to let you guys know I will be in Dallas for the Sneaker Travelers event in August 21st, guys. So make sure you guys pull up if you're in the area in Dallas. See you guys there. I will, should be having a table and all that good stuff too as well. So hope to see you guys there. It's always a good time in Texas, man. So anyway, guys, I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. If you guys don't mind, please hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if it's your first time here. Comment down below and please hit that bell for all the notifications when I do drop vids. And don't forget to follow me on my social media at German Chris on IG, Sunset on Twitter, and don't forget Snapchat. I'm also on TikTok. Anyway, guys, appreciate y'all. Love y'all. I'm German Chris. Peace.